everyone it's tiffany and welcome back to the channel today we're going to be starting my life is strange let's play it's just the first life is strange i'm going to go through each of the games in uh order of how they were released not chronological order because it's completely different but um i will be back with some more sims builds as well as this last play within a week or so i think i have a few of them currently in the works so make sure you come back for those and come back for the rest of the series so let's get started So this isn't like the first time that I've played this. Um, I haven't done like a full playthrough on it ever, but um, I know the basics. I've watched a bunch of people play it. And it is honestly probably one of my favorite games in the entire world. So um, hopefully this is interesting for y'all. Um, Why is the camera so weird? There we go. Holy shit! So surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, His I'm in class. Everything's cool. Room. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victor. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. For you? Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad I can't believe I still have this pencil case. She saw I should torture, upgrade to the right? 21st century. And frankly, it's bullshit. But I like it old school. <laughs> Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. That to me. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. What if Arbus chose to capture people? My little camera bag is battered, but still kicking. She had a brilliant eye, so she could have taken another approach. I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. And I have to get my daily selfie quota. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of post-war beat America. Selfie. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. But a beauty in the struggle. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. 
A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture okay. has always been a vital Douchebags. aspect of art and photography Spoilers. for as long as it's been around. <laughs> now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Let's go with Max. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. She's the so Daguerrean mean. process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Yes, <sighs> Victoria. Hmm. This might make a cool shot. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so... You see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard on the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think everyday heroes. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Poor thing. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. We are going to be the most nicest to Kate in the entire world. You seem world. quiet today. Just because thinking too much. I love her. I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. I hear that. I had my moment in the camera. Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Mm -hmm. Let's hang later. Sure. I want to give her a big hug, honestly. Uh, that printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Looks computer. like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Hmm, not bad. Looks nice. Um, let's see, what else do we got? Damn, they have carbon fiber tripods here. The ball head even has a pan lock? God, I'm such a photo nerd. I straight up have no idea what she just said. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. Don't have too much hope, sweetheart. This is definitely where cameras go to heaven. Oh man, they have those sweet ultrasonic lenses. And look at that vintage rangefinder. What? Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. This is ridiculous. She I always get so a, shy and nervous person. around Mr. Jefferson. Sweetheart, don't. He's a terrible human. You can never escape the lighthouse here. It's so pretty. This area that, that um, it's based off of is even in pictures absolutely stunning. The forest around here <laughs> always looks mysterious. Coming from somebody who's lived in Tennessee her entire life, I just want like a real, actual Man, fall. He even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. So cool that we can check these out anytime. The decisive moment by Henri Cartier-Bresson. That's rare. Any leap of it's mad respect. The amazing Eugene Smith. Good to see Abaddon among the masters. Dolly, of course. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. 
Okay. I bet it gets done every digital amateur. So. But I still dig my little instant camera. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Yeah, well, he sucks anyway, so we'll just ignore him. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know I'm just like completely talking crap about him, but you'll understand. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to pass you always Welcome to the real world. I can't wait to actually like play through this entire thing. Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. I'm not paying she plays it so shy. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. Like me in high school. <laughs> kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. Hopefully, it's not copywritten. That's Dana talking to, I think his name is Justin. Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. They must make them in a factory. Stella is <laughs> always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Poor Daniel, he's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. And here's the star. It looks like she's been gone for months. So the whole game is sort of based around this girl who's missing. Rachel Amber, and this is her missing persons poster. Um, she is absolutely gorgeous. I will say that. Um, let's read it. So, there it is up on the screen if you want to read it and pause it, whatever. And let's keep going. They should just call it a sugar machine. I agree. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Don't need a PC, missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Um, game, because I know everything that's gonna happen, and it's so sad. 
but there's Hayden, it's a good game. another Vortex Club bro, but he's actually not an ass. I haven't played through it in a really long time, so there's Juliet from my dorm. I'm sure Yet another I've forgotten Vortex about Club disciple. Quite a lot. Figures Juliet would be dating Zachary, jocks sucked up in the Vortex Club. Miss Grant is a great science teacher. Another missing person poster. The principal principal doesn't come out of his office much. And somebody over here. He's cute. I like skater boys. Too bad they don't like me. I feel that. The skater boys, skater girls. Just that whole aesthetic. The Bigfoot stop. <laughs> I should develop some school spirit. Go team. Yay, Halloween. My favorite time of year. Same, kiddo. Okay, so we're not ready to go to the main campus yet. We need to go into the bathroom for some time alone, apparently. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. <sighs> um, let's see. What do we need to do here? Sink. Let's splash some water on our face. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Whoa, where did that butterfly come from? It doesn't look like any kind I've ever seen before. The blue wings are practically glowing. I, I can almost feel the air moving around me. The butterfly feels almost like a spirit. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress, you you're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Oh my goodness, what happened? I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer I cannot believe who perfectly this. captured the human condition in black and white? 
Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller? Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images. I did now, it. Can you I actually an did it. A photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human the human time machine. She is so precious. Anybody? <laughs> Max, Diane. don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. So we got Why all of this? Because yeah. of her image. Get it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and When children. I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh. Sounds I believe creepy. Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has, has a gift. gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital yes. aspect of art and photography. I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me he after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again Bulgarian and give him the right answer? Out Wait, what? Now, Max, since you've captured our... The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes. Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just dripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. No matter who wins, this is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel excluded. What are you waiting for? Go! I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. I had my moment in the camera eye, and everybody should oh, have totally. a chance. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future... I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment exactly max don't wait too long john lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans go on now don't let me stop you Totally. I only want right? to share whatever gifts I have. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's... I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, 
You're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. <laughs> I have faith in you. Oh, this game. All right, we need to go to the... I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. All right, well, it's going to be it for this part, so think I'm crazy. make sure you stick around and come back for part two. Bye.